All right, Elton, so let's look at Indianapolis this weekend. First off, the restart zone. You all had implemented at Chicago the restart zone, got moved back before that final corner. We're going to see that again in Indianapolis. What is the hope there? I, I know, it, you know, to try to get these drivers spread out, do you feel like that will be the case at Indianapolis and it will kind of alleviate the carnage that we've seen in turn one? Well, Kelly, that, that's a good point and good question. I, I would look at it from this standpoint. We have one data point by relocating the restart zones, and we go clean back to to Chicago. I thought our drivers and athletes did a great job there. Um, obviously, we dealt with weather there as well, so we were single-file restarts, and, and the start of the race was single-file there just due to the fact that it was um, – you know, we had wet conditions. So um, the goal, as as you mentioned, would be to, you know, clean up the carnage in turn one. Um, so by backing it up, giving the guys the opportunity to get going, uh, maybe the first two or three rows, you know, they've earned the opportunity to have a little bit of an advantage, and we want to give them that. Uh, we will start the weekend as we do every weekend uh, with double file restarts, and if – things happen that we feel like we need to call an audible and go to single file. We have the ability to do that, but, but our race fans for over time have, have come to really enjoy double file restarts. We don't want to take that away um, unless there's a real need to do that. So uh, the goal is yes, to uh, hopefully uh, eliminate some of the carnage in turn in turn one felt like we accomplished that at Chicago. Um, and the goal is to do the same here. And then we will also look as we move forward, uh, Watkins Glen, we've been fortunate in the past, the way that racetrack lays out, uh, there'll be no change at Watkins Glen restart zone will be located in the, in the same place it was in 2022 and, uh, really no restrictions on that one. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then we'll, we'll reassess, uh, as we get to Charlotte and the Roval, uh, in the next, you know, three or four weeks here on what we need to do there as well.